Hello and very warm welcome to Rare Films. This is Farooq Hossain. After a very long time, I'm back with an exciting video tutorial. In this hands-on video tutorial, we will learn about a new tool of Koha Library System, and that tool introduced in uh, Koha 21.05, I guess. But I'm sure with Koha 21.11 and then Koha 22.05 and so on. So through that tool we can upload an e-file not only e-file but we can upload any type of file like uh, either it's document file either it's a pdf file either it's epub file png file jpg file or mp3 file or mp4 file or any type of file like zip file so we can easily upload within koha library system and there's no need for any other external ftp or share folder or uh, what we say uh, google drive or any other drive so and through that tool we can easily access or e-resources within koha library system so here let me open my koha system not my the koha demo system and remember koha demo site is just for practice purpose you just need to write koha demo on your web browser and you can have that alternatively you can visit koha community site and there you can find koha demo here we are so let me select this 22.05 staff interface and the staff staff one so let me log in here and this video is on demand video uh one of my subscriber he actually follow me on twitter so he asked me about that he indicate about that tool so his name is Evans. So thank you very much, Evans, for uh, indicating me to this important tool. And this video is actually dedicated to you. So thank you once again for this important point. So here in tools, we have three columns and the last column is additional tools. And the second last option is to upload any type of file manage upload so we just need to upload here and we can upload any file permanently or temporarily and we can allow public to have that file to look that file to download that file and here we can check already uploaded file through search category this one is the search category and here we can use hash value to search a file so let us see is there any file available so here we have one file so back to upload once again and let us try to upload one file here so 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 we can upload any video file we can upload zip file we can upload any document file we can upload any PDF file or EPUB file or whatever we want to upload. So let us upload one video file here with the permanent file upload and we will allow public to have that file. So there you need to upload this file. And it's actually depend on the size of the file. So try to upload some standard size of file, not too heavy file. So we can copy this. We can download here or we can delete any file here. So let me copy this. And now let me open my catalog. So let me search here example book 
search. Here we have multiple records. So let me open this one. And we can edit this. Edit record. Normally we add the link in 800 tag with 856 so 856 u is for url i mean uh, uniform resource identifier so we just provide paste the link here and uh, what text we need to see against this link so for example like click here to access the video book this is just for example so 8563 and 856 u and let me save this so we need to add it uh, 003 and 942 okay 003 is actually control number identifier where we just need to click uh, actually when we upload in a batch format so normally these field skipped so now we can save this and 942 is for item type and there you can see online resource click here to access the video book and we can check this in OPAC as well so when we click here the book is start downloading see so we are providing one uh, e-resource i mean the video format through the koha system and there's no other external uh, place required to have the e-resource now we can have the e-resources within koha library system permanently so, so, so that's one of the wonderful tool and thank you Evans for, 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 uh, for indicating me, uh, for this video. So thank you very much and keep watching. And this way you can upload multiple files here in tools. And you can upload a number of files here. PDF Community So you can copy this So far we have uploaded two files here and one is already accessed with the prior someone uploaded here and you can keep your file here as well to download for further purpose I mean if you want to save your file here for example someone actually saved his mark record here I don't know who but someone saved here so you can also save here but 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 this is a good option to link your e-resources with your catalog system that's all for today and thank you very much for watching this video keep watching and thank you once again and take care yourself